There are moments when it's so quiet, silent. 7 p.m., I just took a shower. I just spoke to my Italian bank. Oh my God, it's so silent. I adore when it's like this. Oh, such a serenity. We cut these bamboo trees off just to give way, freeway here. So we cut two bamboo trees here that hinders a little bit of the path. But I didn't expect it to be so much that comes down. Wow, how many bamboo straws I can make, but my uh, former gardener was good at it, but this one, not for bamboo straw though. I'm waiting for the cable TVs technicians to come because now they say they can install without the cable. So that would entail less work, right? And so I would have my uh, YouTube also here to watch instead of always going to my bedroom. And what's so good about it is that now you can always add another room if you need and just uh, pay around five euros additional, something like that. So it's very practical, convenient, not like in the past where you had to pay the whole package when you don't use the three bedrooms to watch the cable at all. Now I have in my room and then this room edit because the ex lodger had his independently. I think he used VPN if I'm not mistaken. And then I will have that room also and uh, my daughter's room if need be. That is, I love the options. Hello guys, I am here waiting to go to the new supermarket which happens to be my favorite. Well, second favorite. That is just newly changed to this um, old supermarket that I hardly go or I never even went for two years already. And it's only not even two kilometers from here. So I'm looking forward to going there today after almost three months not going out at all, even though another two days things will be lifted from the lockdown that is not totally, but still, um, I prefer to go out after that actually, but anyway, I can't wait. It's a beautiful day and I'd like to take my time to go in this supermarket that's not far from my house, even though I still need Uber car to go there, which only costs not even one euro at all. Therefore, I am ready to go there. However, the technician of my cable TV that yesterday came already, but today they will complete it, are not here yet. They promised at 11 a.m., but now it's already past noon. They forgot that today is Friday, so they're at the mosque, but they're coming after that and uh, just finalized the connection. And uh, that would be in the ex lodger's bedroom, which will be my TV viewing room downstairs instead of coming to my bedroom all the time. And those are the two rooms that are connected to the cable TV, which is much better today as a um, system because before they used to just have it lump sum, whether you have one TV or two TVs, but now they have one TV. And then if you want to add, you just add another maybe five to seven euros. That's all, which is very, very convenient and practical. And so I have two other bedrooms that are not connected, which are not um, important but or necessary. But if I do want to do that, then it can be done. But now I notice it will take a few 
days because first the appointment then second they will come maybe a few days later and then they'll do it in two days before it was immediate so it has changed the way they do things here guys I didn't go up the two technicians came very very late like three hours four hours as promised and still here after more than one hour just running up and down up and down even taking the TV upstairs because they had to tune it up close to the modem upstairs where my office desk is and um, rather than running up and down, up and down, they took the TV upstairs. And they're still here. Two young boys, so maybe they're not experienced. And also it's a mistake maybe the fact that I chose to be wireless. Because I was offered, do you want wireless or do you want with cable? I thought by opting for the wireless one would be the faster installation because the existing one is by cable which was installed in one day but I didn't know that it would be so so complicated since yesterday they were here and then today they are here and still no sign that they've resolved it I have no idea what it is that is without cable I don't understand what it is so I'm a little bit piffed because now I don't go out. It's okay, maybe it's better to stay home, but I did order like 70% of what I wanted to buy in the supermarket by uh, Go Mart, so they will deliver. But the other 30% I would have to buy myself Maybe if there's still time, I'd uh, just pop in there later on because it's, after all, it's very close anyway. So I let's see. I decided to move place instead of there. Now I am going to sit here. It's sunny, but it's occasional cloudy. The pool is really clean. I love it. Today is Saturday, so I'm going to hang out here all afternoon. As right now, it's a little bit past noon. Also, I'm waiting for the cable technicians to come and finish it up once and for all with the new cable, extended cable that is to connect to this TV. In wow, this it's room. working. So I have this remote control that has nothing to do with the gimbal or tripod that I used to have. I just uh, took it out from it. And then with this new gimbal that is cheaper, lighter and practical as well, that I'm using right now for the first time, which is great. I could use this remote control from the old gimbal or tripod so i'm very very happy about it wow this is great what a lovely day to spend by the pool oh, it's beautiful oh my god and i'm just waiting again for the technicians all right they should be here any minute once and for all once and for all done so i could watch my youtube or whatever or movie in the downstairs bedroom which is great <laughs> and I did also my bed and breakfast uh, advertisement booking.com I used to have it but then I uh, stopped it like what two years ago because it went a little bit haywire why because one whole family booked the whole house and they paid already without checking with me that this house is not to be rented whole 
as one unit, but it has to be bed and breakfast rooms, like two or maximum three bedrooms. But they wanted the whole house and they paid without checking that it's non-refundable. So I received the money from them without them using this uh, accommodation. But they are from Oman, so you can, you know, draw conclusion they must be very, very rich because they didn't mind. And that was good. That was the time when I just arrived back from Italy. Then their system of payment is like you receive the guests today, you can only receive the payment the month after the mid month. So it takes a long time to receive the payment. Hence for enough capital for you to prepare the guests with their food already that you have on hand, you know? Because you can't count on the payment by the guests since they only will be transferred to you one month later. And if that one month later is the first of month, no, no, no. It has to be past the 15th of next month. So it takes a long time for you to receive the actual payment. And that was the drawback. But now, okay, I re-register again. And let's see, even though now we are in the pandemic era, I don't know whether I will get guests or not, but I do need a little bit of uh, revamp of the room, a little bit, especially the pool room. So let's go and check my newly installed cable channel in downstairs bedroom. Let me just change my sandals. So there it is, it's on. So now I can watch in this room without going upstairs. The technicians just left. So nice and breezy. So can you see? Oh, it's lovely to be able to watch from here. Oh, lovely. So nice. I don't have to go upstairs anymore to watch on TV screen or TV monitor. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, going back. Okay, I'm going to swim soon, yeah, wash I my hair. This is it because for the first time I could make the Italian cake. Orange cake that is. A little bit, they call it ciambellone, which means donut, but it's not donut. This is just like sponge cake, but thicker with orange flavor. We have to wait until it is cold. Then we pour the icing sugar. I didn't sleep until 6 a.m. last night because I watch a soap opera now on YouTube that I accidentally bump into, into let's say, that I started watching episode one thinking, oh, 
just a Turkish kind of uh, soap opera, which I never, never, never like to watch. I did once used to watch Argentinian soap opera in Italy when the TV there didn't have English speaking cable channels yet. So I had no choice but to watch the TV there and I was uh, enjoying this Argentinian telenovela they say or uh, soap opera which helped me with learning Italian a bit. That was all, but this time it is the Turkish telenovela or soap opera, which I couldn't stop watching and I'm on episode 26. Can you believe it? Last night I f fell asleep a little bit, just very, very lightly, and then I continued until 6 a.m. It's crazy, you know? Oh my God, I love it. Maybe I have past all the different kinds of stages in life that now my concentration on this kind of uh, story or pastime becomes much more enhanced and so enjoyable. So every night I look forward to it. Oh, oh my God, I love it. So here I am in the ex lodger's room. From now on, I call it Melati room. Melati in Indonesian, it's a jasmine flower, all right? So in English, it's jasmine. Whereas the main room for bed and breakfast, the, yes. bed, the bed and breakfast room is called mawar, which means rose. So mawar melati. This is more for bed and breakfast or lodging. While that one is strictly for bed and breakfast. So it's Mawar, Rose, M-A-W-A-R, and Melati, Jasmine, M-E-L-A-T-I. So I'm sitting here and I feel so relaxed. It's crazy because when I sit by the pool, I feel so relaxed. If Every corner of this house makes you feel so relaxed if I do say so myself. It's not to brag, but it's the fact. <laughs> and oh my God, the breeze is just perfect, even though we are in the uh, supposed to be dry season, but it rained a little bit today, just very, very briefly. Oh my God, I enjoy so much, you know, my day at home. <sighs> I couldn't, I couldn't uh, ask for more. It's so beautiful. Today is my pink, red, blue, and white kind of flock summer color outfits. So this is the pink I wear at home. That's all. And then um, that's it. What else to say? For now, this is all my vlog. <clears throat> I think tomorrow they will be open in Jakarta from lockdown, I hope. It's supposed to be today, officially, but let's hope things will be back to normal, even though it's partly, but at least we can go to the malls again. What else to do in Jakarta? But you know, one more discovery that I just realized which is only like 20 minutes maximum 30 minutes from my house is the national garden of indonesia which i should share with you even though it's quite hard to go there but i i will go there and show it to you so yes i am also exploring myself my own country and uh, I had to learn new things because I have left this country for decades. That's why for the last three years that I live here, I picked up a lot of things. And only today I realized that that National Garden Indonesia uh, park like representing all the different tradition by every 
part of Indonesia is there, which is only maximum 30 minutes from my place. So, okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little simple relaxing vlog. Nothing heavy to digest. Just passing your time, enjoying yourself lightly. All right, so hope new viewers subscribe and like and comment and then i hope wherever you are you are doing well okay so in the meantime i hope to see you in my next video take care ciao ciao arrivederci